Hi guys. <laughs> Welcome to another vlog with David. Yes, hello. <laughs> Sorry, I sound all snuffled up, but I am at that stage of pregnancy where I am just ready to have this child. <laughs> Very ready. The sun is out. If you're wondering why we're wearing sunglasses in February. It's like two degrees Celsius, but the sun is out. So what? Okay. <laughs> I mean, we're in the car. We might as well pretend like it's really warm outside. <laughs> Let's talk about where we're going. I have no idea, so I can't tell you where we're going. Basically, this is an Ellie Valentine's Day surprise that David had for me. Yes. He told me about this last week and he's like, make sure that your Friday is free. <laughs> We're gonna drop Kian off at crash and I'm taking you somewhere. There we go. <laughs> yeah, because Valentine's uh, this uh, year falls on a Wednesday, which is quite random. So I thought, you know, um, to have a little bit of a pre-Valentine surprise today, um, you know, an extended weekend, I think, which is nice. So I'm taking her um, out today. You will see soon where. Now, it is obviously related to relaxation and just having yeah, a great time together. That's that, all that I know. That's, I, that's what I know because I was like, boy, you better give me a clue <laughs> yeah, so I know how to dress. In light of the fact that it's all about relaxation, I didn't want to wear heavy makeup. So I have no makeup on. But yes, that's about the only thing I know. And I oh. thought I had an idea where. But since we've left the house and we're driving in a completely different direction, <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I have no idea where we're going. There we go. But that's good for once. For once, Adana <laughs> has not yet found out about a surprise. Yeah, okay, this is something you guys have to know. So David, nine out of ten times, has not successfully pulled out a surprise. Yep. Because I'm just very curious and nosy. Yep. And my radar is just up when I notice David's acting a bit weird. I'm just like, boy, come here. What's happening? <laughs> he's always manages to ruin a surprise. So, yeah. Well, obviously, yeah. Well, now I know that when he's acting dodgy, I have to turn it down because he has to be <laughs> with my, my own benefit. But back in the day, it's like, mm-mm, mm-mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> I need to know. Me you tell on. me what's going on. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking forward to a full day of relaxation because the last week and a half or two weeks have not been great kian has been ill and you know we thought it was just a normal cold and then we thought it was teething but he actually developed a chest infection had to go to hospital starting on antibiotics and then just as he was getting better i became ill mm. so the last it's life yeah this is life i'm actually looking forward to a full day of relaxation I know where we are <laughs> so we're at the Royal Marine Hotel which you guys don't know but this was one of the hotels that we looked at when we were looking for venues to get married yes this was one of the first ones we looked at obviously we settled for something else
first treatment now, the facial. Um, I don't know, has now been in the, I think, floating or hydrotherapy um, room. Um, and we're gonna switch. I'm gonna go over, see how she's doing. Um, and then she's gonna get her facial again. I'll go over to the hydrotherapy. But um, man, that felt good. This was great, oh, this is amazing. Yeah. <laughs> you like it? Thank you, Joe. Wow. Mm -hmm. Of course. <laughs> so we've finished with all the treatments now. We've uh, rested for another, what are the two, three hours now, and we're heading home now to see Kian. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, comment below if you can see any difference in my skin. <laughs> Besides the fact that my cheeks are a bit chummy. Like <laughs> you can see in your face that you're relaxed and I'm happy. So, guys, <laughs> like I went for a full body pregnancy massage, <laughs> fell asleep there, went for a facial, fell asleep, <laughs> went for another treatment, fell asleep, fell asleep, then went to the floating bed and fell asleep. Yep. I've slept everywhere. It's good. We're driving home now, I shall fall asleep. I might fall asleep in the car, but. Yeah, I just wanted to say a big thank you to David. Of course, you thank deserve you it. <laughs> All the women there obviously knew that David had the surprise, so eventually they're like, oh, isn't he sweet? Surprising you, isn't he sweet? I'm like, yeah, I know he's very sweet. <laughs> So it's barely 8 o'clock this morning and I'm already out of breath and the reason for it is that uh, Kian and I are in the park <laughs> um, because Kian uh, well, had a typical Kian night I would say eventually we got up early had breakfast and um, he always is very active especially in the morning but I think that's normal um, but he loves it outside now it's not as cold anymore but I put him in a bit of a you know sort of a snow suit just because of the cold he was having and you're not feeling 100% so it's better better safe than sorry or rather sorry again but um, right Kian you having a good time yeah you having a good time Vroom. clearly oh I think I need to be careful <laughs> but the good thing is he slowly gets a sense for like speed and stuff so he actually can break by himself now which is good makes my job a little easier so Adana isn't feeling actually well this morning at all she's quite sick this morning so she's resting had a terrible night so i really need to make sure that i'll watch out for kian as much as i can kian come this way bye 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 here no no this way we're going here. There you go. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, so I really I really need to make sure that I take care of Kin today because yeah, she's not feeling good at all. I mean it's kind of normal with the pregnancy symptoms, so it's nothing necessarily out of the ordinary, but it's still very tough on her. Very hard. That's okay, a few weeks to go. That's all I can tell her. <laughs> Kian, stop! Kian, stop! <laughs> this boy! Baba! You need to stop! Look at you! You don't want to stop! Oh! So after a short one hour nap that Kian had, we're now out to do some groceries. Kiki, where's our car? 
Show me. Go, 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 go. Show me our car. Yeah, yeah, that's our car. Hi guys, I've been MIA in this vlog hour <laughs> because <laughs> I haven't been feeling well. I'm actually really, really ill to the point to the point that <laughs> David's, just, David's just making Kia laugh to the point that if I remain this ill tomorrow, I might actually go to the hospital. That's how unwell I am. But um, as per usual. <laughs> David's really helping around the house and basically doing everything because I've been bed bound and couch bound. <laughs> yeah, as we mentioned in a few vlogs, there's a few changes that we're making in the house. Um, most of it is before the baby arrives, but the rest of it is just changing things around the house. And one of the things is that mirror above the fireplace there is going to be replaced by i can't even talk without kia <laughs> so that mirror above the fireplace if you guys are following me on insta story you know that we do have a mirror above the fireplace that's going to be replaced by a tv because our tv currently sits on there and it's not one of the smart tvs it's a tv that i but when I first moved to Ireland, in a bit, you guys will see that the TV has gone up, which is exciting. I apologize again if you don't see me a lot in this vlog, but I'm really, really unwell, unfortunately. David's getting really excited by this. So many cool options here. It's a 55 inch and it doesn't look as big as it actually is. <laughs> the camera doesn't make yeah. it look as big. Okay. So, after a little lunch break with unhealthy burgers, but uh, I have to say very juicy burgers, <laughs> and um, a bit of time spent with um, Adana now as well, which was nice. Um, I am out now again with Kian because um, we just needed to give Adana a bit more time. Uh, in as much as it was nice to be with her in the house and she really wanted to also not just to lie on the sofa the whole day, um, it just was a bit too much for her. So, uh, and good thing is I had to run some errands anyway, so I'm out now, I dropped my jacket um, with a tailor. There's some alterations. And I thought, you know, afterwards I'll go with Kian here to the seaside, which is just close by, which is great. As soon as we get out of the car, this boy just fell asleep. Completely left me hanging here, so I just decided to go to the seaside anyway because it's just nice <laughs> and it's still bright. So, going for a little stroll now with Sleepy Kian um, by the water, just enjoy the fresh air. Another thing, by the way, that I've been reflecting on quite a bit today in the last few days is just how strong Adana is. And not just in general, because I mean, you know, that she's generally very strong, but especially these days with the pregnancy and everything. I mean, if I just imagine that she's already going through a pregnancy and now all these symptoms that are coming with it, you know, the flu and, you know, and what all that she has, the nose and everything, man, it's, it's really, it's terrible to see her suffer any day on a normal day, but then seeing her suffer now like this during even a pregnancy, I just really have to, yeah, my head's off 
which is incredible honestly so I'm very happy to do all this stuff now to get her as much rest and energy as possible so so literally as we <laughs> get back to the car to drive home because I thought well you know I've done my round here now it's getting dark this fella here Kian huh <laughs> as you can see he just woke up still very sleepy look you gonna say hi yeah you say hi Hi! <laughs> but um, yeah, at least he had a bit of a nap, so that's good. So let's head back now, Kian. Um, let's head to, uh, back home to Adana. Tonight we are running on the right track. I know we never gonna look back. Oh, I just wanna have a good time. Call me whatever. Some... Good morning, how are you? What is this? This is one of Kian's favorite activities actually is painting although well you can judge for yourself you know um, apparently well besides the brown one which is mine um, Kian in the green color he's seeing um, trees so he's been drawing trees right? Yeah. Okay um, he also has been drawing um, apparently dogs um, and a car somewhere. I think down here he said this was a car. So I would say, you know, big future ahead yeah. as an artist. Yeah. Right? The problem with these three dimensional books is that Kian always immediately starts ripping them apart. I don't think there's one single page where Kian hasn't destroyed something yet. <coughs> Bless you. You have to come down. Why are you hiding behind the blinds, huh? Do you want to come out? <laughs> what are you eating? Some biscuit. Could you give baby a biscuit? Yeah, can you share with baby? Give baby a kiss? Oh, nice. And can you give him some biscuit? Yay. Yay! So Madame here is unfortunately still not better, but she just came down. Oh, look at you. <laughs> Sorry, babe. I feel bad that you have to do literally everything in this house. No, that's fine, babe. That's okay. You're sick, so... <laughs> How's baby doing? Good. Yeah? Yeah. Not bothering you too much? No. <laughs> oh, Kian. Kian was nice earlier. Yeah. Trying to give it his biscuit. <laughs> he always wants to share everything. Yeah. Oh, that's very nice. Ah. Yeah, just well, so you need to rest. So, as I'm now taking another stroll through the park with Kian to give Adana a bit of space and proper time uh, to rest, we will probably have to say goodbye now. Apologies again for the rather unusual vlog this week. Um, apologies for having to keep up with my face <laughs> all the time. But we hope you understand. Um, we all wish you a great week ahead. And we'll let you know how Adana is getting on. So let me just get back now and focus on getting Adana back to shape again. And um, take care of Keen, of course. Thank you so much for watching this week. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so already. All the best from Dublin. Bye bye.